what's going on virgos it's sugar monique well well guan all right this is going to be the bi-weekly tower reading for you guys december 23rd until january 6th please like the video leave a comment telling me it just resonated with you in any way subscribe to the channel always check the description box and the pinned comment in the comment section for not only my information but all the spiritual businesses that i support bitch i don't know why she don't want light bitch Okay, there we go. Alright, alright, alright. I don't know why she acting funny. Okay. Thank you guys for all the support, the bookings, the likes, the subscriptions. You guys got me over 6,000 subscribers before the end of the year. That shit is crazy, son. Okay. It looked like I might hit 65 before the end of the year. I don't want to get too crazy, though, because I didn't even think I was going to get 6,000. Like, I was like, I'll probably hit five, but girl i hit six thousand that shit is wild thank y'all so much i really appreciate it okay y'all be telling people about me and that's crazy thank you okay so virgo sun moon rising mercury venus mars jupiter saturn north node south node placements okay check your birth chart this might resonate with you in some way if not the whole message a piece all right Ooh. hey virgo y'all trying to keep it together but some shit just you know coming out of nowhere on your ass all right Speaking up, coming out of nowhere. Virgo! Coming out of nowhere. It's not over. You know, you know what this is, you know, pertaining to, right, Virgo? A relationship. What else could it be? Okay? Then I just say, she just flying out the woodworks on your ass. Okay? So I think this pertains to a relationship. Okay? It's not over. All right? I just saw watch the planets in the cosmos as well. So the planetary uh, transits, like where uh, the different planets sit in, whenever it comes to zodiac signs, will be helping you uh, realize the different energies going on right now. Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. Mm -mm, mm -mm, I don't like it. That shuffle was messy. So was that. <laughs> that shuffle was messy. Hold on. All right. Damn. All the shuffles are messy. Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. Virgo, be mindful. Virgo, be mindful. There's a friend of me around you. Okay, there's somebody who cannot be trusted. Okay? It can't be trusted. Alright, I'm hearing this is somebody who will smile in your face, but they'll do some grimy shit behind your back, yo. Alright? Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? Jan See, this shit ain't going to apply in December. I said January for uh, the Cancer Zodiac, too. Is this shit going to be happening in January? Talk it out. Girl, is it with this friend of me, girl? Okay. Okay, they're saying that you need to talk it out with somebody. All right. I'm saying that because it's the same color as that friend of me card, okay? So maybe you view somebody as a friend of me, okay? I don't know, girl, because you need to pay attention to the sign. So they're telling me that you can decipher on whether or not you can trust this person or not. But I do feel like you and this person need to have a conversation of some sort. Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. <laughs> that wants to come out. Pay attention to the signs. Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd. Damn, yo, everything just fell out, son. So I feel like y'all going to be finding something out over these next two weeks that kind of puts you in this position of like everything led up to this. Like, you you know, there was signs telling you that this shit was going to happen. OK, but just telling you that this shit was uh, on the way. All right. But pay attention to the signs. OK. Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. I'm not going to put these down because I plucked two. So, let's see. Message. All right. Take a break and major purchase is in reverse. Okay. So, Virgo, there might have been something as to where um, you wanted to invest in and the universe stopped your ass because it wasn't for you. Okay. They was trying to stop you from making a major purchase. Okay. This could have been pertaining to something like... Like, it could have been pertaining to taking a break. Okay. Maybe it was a vacation or something like that. Okay. The universe was telling you, like, it's not the time. Maybe. Okay. Or like I said, there was something that the universe, uh, you know, wanted you to, you know, not invest in. Okay. Message. Pull back your energy. There was something that the universe did not want you to invest in. They wanted you to, you know, halt. Okay. Who goes there? 
Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. Last card. Pay attention to the signs. So now we got to watch the planets and the cosmos. So definitely where the planets sit, we'll be giving you hints as to what the fuck is going on. Okay? What's on the bottom of the deck? Keep it low key. Keep it low key. I don't know what. I don't know what, honey. Okay? I picked up the deck. And look what's on the bottom. Don't believe the hype. Now, this came out for um cancer, too. Okay? I hope cancer ain't waiting on no goddamn tax return to get their money up, girl. But there's something that you guys don't need to invest in. Don't invest your money in it because you don't need to believe the hype. And this is also the same color as Watch the Planets in the Cosmos, okay? So there's something that's going to be happening. Now, it's not the same color card, but it's the same color writing. So um, there's going to be some sort of planetary transit to where a certain planet goes in a certain so zodiac to where it's going to explain why certain energies are happening around you or why things are a certain way around you, okay? But don't believe the hype. Pull back your energy and don't invest into something whenever it comes to a major pur purpose. Purpose? Major pur purchase. But there's a purpose. Okay? Who we using, girl? Okay? I kind of want to get a little bit spiritual and shot. Okay? So let me use crystal. Okay, nine of pentacles, Virgo, you showing up already, okay, bills is paid, we are focusing on the money right now, okay, I just heard we trying to pay the bill, <laughs> I was like, bills are paid, and someone was like, girl, we trying to pay the bills, <laughs> ain't that the truth, okay, yep, six of pentacles in the nine, heavy Virgo energy, you like, girl, um, okay, it might be a little bit late, honey, but yeah, they paid, <laughs> I feel you, okay, like, for real, okay, so, Ace of Pentacles. All right, so Virgo, what's going on here? Okay, there could be some sort of income coming into you over these next two weeks. Um, this is something that you wasn't expecting. This is it's a gift from the universe. Christmas money. Don't tell don't tell nobody that I told you. Okay, but that's just what I'm picking up. All right, you could be. It's just like you you wasn't expecting this from the universe. Ah, the universe be working like a motherfucker. Okay, Leo energy. Okay, yeah, you're gonna be getting some sort of money. All right, Leo energy that comes from the universe and it's like thank god okay you know like it was like shit i really needed that okay spirits clarify this frenemy card for the virgo zodiac december 23rd until january 6th oh no three of swords oh no i'm over here dancing this shit and i don't even realize it Virgo. Yeah, that's somebody who is like, damn, yo, I hate to see a friendship like this, kid. Okay, so there could be a Libra up in here with the two of swords, like, yeah. There could be a situation as you trying to make a decision on whether or not you need to cut a Libra off, okay? Because this person could have hurt your feelings I'm hearing. Like, this person, like, did some grimy shit, okay? Page of Pentacles. They could have been having to do with some money, okay? Or just investing in something, okay? Nine of Wands. It's something that you was kind of guarded against. It could be with a Sagittarius or with another Earth sign. Or maybe this was you, okay? Virgo, you was being guarded whenever it came to something involving a Virgo, okay? Eight of Swords with the Seven of Wands. So, there was something that you felt like you wasn't clear on. Eight minus three is five of Swords, okay? I just felt like you felt like somebody was just, you know, popping their gums. They wasn't really talking, you know, no real shit, Okay, or you could find that somebody was talking shit about you, okay, and with the Eight of Swords, you kind of, um, I'm hearing like you wasn't, you know, blindsided by it, but it was kind of like, damn, yo, you've been talking all this shit about me, son, okay, could be with a Seven of Wands, or it could be with a Leo, and you kind of like, oh, okay, I'm blocking you, okay, no, spirits, clarify this friend of me card for the Virgo Zodiac, December 26th, no, Oh, Lord. Pay attention to December 26th. Virgo, what's going on? Spirits, what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac? December 23rd until January 6th. Chariot, okay? Could be with the Cancer as well, with the Eight of Wands. Yeah, somebody's about to move on from a certain friendship, okay? Could be with the Cancer or a heavy Sagittarius energy as well, okay? Yeah, you find out that a friend can't be trusted, Okay, like this person uh, could have did like, I'm just hearing this person could have ran out on you. Or maybe this person, like I'm hearing like maybe somebody left you with a bill. Something like that. Because the Page of Pentacles came out. Somebody left you with a bill, eight of wands. And they like ran out on your ass, okay. 
um maybe you know you had a roommate or some shit and girl you just came home and all they shit was gone you like this motherfucker here you know like you was like that okay because we got cherry and the eight of wands like i'm hearing like if you like in a roommate situation maybe somebody just decide to like run out on your ass and they ain't even tell you you know what i'm saying like you just walk in oh girl don't tell me january 2nd you come back to your crib and you like feel a little feel a little uh a little different okay you just walk around you realize this motherfucker to pack up all that shit like spirits clarify this frenemy card for the virgo zodiac mm. i don't know why my nose is girl seven of pentacles virgo what's going on here with the magician virgo energy so be careful because somebody could have been plotting Virgo, somebody could have, like, purposely did this to you. Somebody could have been out on your ass on purpose, okay? They was waiting on the perfect time to execute this shit with the Magician card, okay? This could have been a masculine energy as well. King of Wands, Leo or Aries. Like, somebody was waiting on the perfect moment to just be like, I'm out, bitch, okay? Left you with the rent for January, okay? Knight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, and the Moon card. Right when I said that, left you with the rent for uh, January, yeah. Now somebody sitting on their flow like, what the fuck am I about to do? Okay, they got their fruit, they got their fruit in their goddamn lap. Like, what the fuck? Like, Knight of Pentacles, Taurus, Five of Pentacles, Taurus, the Moon card, Cancer, or a Pisces. Okay, we got to have a Cancer energy up in here. Yeah, somebody kept it a secret that they was plotting to get out of a certain situation. I'm hearing somebody got tired of being poor with somebody. Damn, motherfucker was like, I'd rather be poor by myself than be poor with you, okay? Not our business, okay? Yeah, Knight of Pentacles, I told you, somebody was plotting. Somebody was plotting to do this for a minute, okay? They was just waiting on the, the, the best time, okay? Somebody could be doing this to you over the next two weeks, kid. You like that motherfucker, you know? But with the Magician and the King of Wands showing up, this person was real slick. Like, I'm hearing, like, this person, you know... Girl, you never, you never would have expected it. The motherfucker just bought you breakfast last Monday, okay? Motherfucker just took me, okay? My bad. <laughs> motherfucker just took me to breakfast time the other motherfucking morning. Like, spirits, clarify this friend of me card for the Virgo Zodiac, December 23rd until January 6th. Three of Cups. Damn, it's a friend. It's a friend, honey, okay? Could be with a, it could be a cancer. Um, yeah, it's a friend, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the higher fan on the bottom of the deck, this also could go for some sort of commitment. I'm hearing, like, if you was in a relationship, like, you could have found this person had somebody on the side the entire time, okay? Or your friend could have known about this shit. Your friend could have known that whoever you was with, okay, or whoever this person was with, was dealing with somebody and they ain't tell you and they helped this person get their shit out your house, okay? They called Tyrone, okay? Help him come get your shit. <laughs> Help him come get your shit. Okay, like somebody called Tyrone, okay? Somebody, you know, somebody friend knew about this shit the entire time and helped them move out of the situation. Like I said, it could have been in a relationship. Okay, if it wasn't like a marriage, like a commitment, like how a higher fan is, okay, it could have been situations where these two shared an asset. We got the chariot here, so this, so these two people could have just shared a car, okay? Somebody was waiting, bitch. I hope somebody ain't ran off with your motherfucking car, Virgo. Put an APB out on that bitch, all right? Four of cups, good lord. Heavy cancer energy, yeah. Somebody just don't want to be in this shit no more. Three of swords. <sighs> I'm hearing the way that they leaving though, because this is over the next two weeks. The way that they leaving though is kind of like damn kid, because they having their friend, they um, they friends help them out. I'm hearing somebody having their homeboy, you know, Tyrone. Tyrone is in effect. Okay, somebody having Tyrone um come and help to get their shit. <laughs> oh my god, honey. Okay. So I'm telling me you need to be mindful of this friend though, Virgo. Okay, whatever um friend that's helping you out with this, you might need to be careful about this friend. Because like I said, it says friend of me, okay? Something ain't right. Something ain't right with that. We got the world card, yeah. Knight of Swords. Somebody is definitely out on a certain situation though. Most definitely, okay? Yeah, they in a certain situation. They feel like they've outgrown this, okay? Spirits, clarify friend of me for the uh, Virgo, Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. I be feeling like that woman in Bewitch. You know what she be doing there? And I'm like, come on. And I be like, mm. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, that could be me. Six of Wands. Okay, so there could be a Leo here. Ooh, Lord, with the Empress on the bottom of the deck. Okay, so 
third party situation here definitely somebody's friend knew know that somebody was in a third party situation and they knew that you know this person wanted to get out of the situation and they they helped this person get out of the situation okay and i think this person might be a friend of me because they cool with whoever this person is in a relationship with virgo could be a leo a cancer or a libra all right with the empress card on the bottom of the deck hell yeah okay the emperor and the empress girl okay so yeah this was two people together honey okay these were two people together all right what's the situation here man Somebody could also be finding out that somebody friend want that girl. Like the motherfucker a little bit too 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 friendly with your girl, okay? Motherfucker be trying to give her a hug and shit. Like, nah, you can dap her up on me. I don't know how y'all be feeling about that. For for me, okay, like dap me up, homie. Don't don't be trying to hug me in front of my man's, okay? Don't be trying to hug me in front of your homeboy. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Dap me up. Alright, we don't need to do all that, alright? Because I don't like I don't like touching on niggas like that. You ain't mine, nigga. Okay, but whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Cause these are two. Th th these are supposed to be counterparts. Okay, the emperor and the empress. But like, I'm telling you, there's a friend of me in this situation. Like somebody helped somebody get out of a certain situation, but they was a friend to the other person as well. Eight of Wands. I'm telling you, somebody helping somebody move. What's on the bottom of the motherfucking dick? Okay, high priestess. I told you. <laughs> Fuck be with shit. All right. Could be a mystic in the building. All right. They quiet though. Six of swords. They ain't getting involved in this shit. All right. Mm hmm. Yeah, somebody moving in silence. All right. Because somebody's intuition is telling them to. Somebody's intuition is telling them to get out of a situation before it's too late. I'm hearing. Could be with a Sag or a Taurus. Okay. Spirits, clarify, pay attention to the signs for the Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. Re reminder, December 26th is going to be an important day or something's just going to happen on that day. So, Two of Swords. So, we went from the Three to the Two of Swords. Okay? So, with the Eight of Cups. So, somebody made a decision to walk away from a third-party situation because they felt like somebody was putting them in a stalemate. Okay? But there's still something there. Okay? Libra energy with the Pisces energy. All right? Yeah, somebody's not wanting to see something for what it is. Somebody's ignoring the signs, actually. They don't want to see something for what it is, okay? Spirits, clarify this. Pay attention to the signs whenever it comes to the Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. Nine of Pentacles. Is this you, Virgo? Is this you? Okay. I don't know, girl. Four of Cups. Could be a cancer up in here as well. Okay. Yeah, there's something that you kind of don't want to like. Mm. So we got the page of swords coming out. But it came out in reverse. Yeah, I'm hearing somebody don't want to like see something. Like somebody doesn't want to investigate something. Because I'm hearing they kind of already know what the, what the situation is. Okay. Six of Swords, so they rather just, you know, be quiet. Being a Nine of Cups energy to where it's just like, you know what, I'm cool just knowing whatever the fuck I know. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they rather just be like that. Spirits, clarify, um, pay attention to the signs for the Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. What time is it? Gotta head out a little bit. All right, High Priestess. Okay, so we got the Judgment card on the bottom of the day. Yeah, man, somebody intuition is popping. Pay attention to the signs. Virgo, your intuition is gonna be telling you over these, telling you some of these next two weeks that you're trying to ignore. Stop it, okay? Because with the chariot card, you're gonna have to move on from something. Somebody might might, might have to act, make it. Somebody might have to make an actual move, okay? But somebody could be being guided by their intuition to make this move. All right. I'm also hearing somebody's playing stupid because the two of swords and the high priest is here. So this person might look like they're not making a decision. But in reality, bitch, I already know what the fuck I'm about to do, bitch. I'm just not letting you ass know. Okay? It's like that kind of situation. Judgment card. This person already know what they're about to do because the heavens are telling them what to do. Okay? Could be a Scorpio energy up in here. 
spirits, clarify, pay attention to the signs for the Virgo Zodiac, December 26th until January. Something happened December 26th, Virgo. Clarify what's going on with the Virgo Zodiac, but pay attention to the signs, December 23rd until January 6th. Three of Wands. I'm telling you, this happening in the future. You see how she holding that orb? Let's look into the crystal ball, okay? That type of thing, all right? My seeing this, pay attention to the signs. Virgo, you're going to be shown this, okay? I don't know what the hell this is. I don't know if you're being shown who this frenemy is, who is taking off on your ass in the middle of the night, okay? You're going to be shown a vision of this whenever it comes to one of your friends or just somebody who is a friend of me. Some, you're going to be shown who is not to be trusted in your circle. It could be a Cancer or it could be an Aries or it could be a Taurus or it could be a Scorpio. Five of Cups. You're going to be a little bit upset. Like you're going to be like King of Cups and the Six of Swords with the Seven of Cups. I wanted to say, you're going to kind of just be like, damn, yo, how did I not see that? Like, it's going to be that kind of situation, okay? But with the King of Cups and the Six of Swords, yeah. This could be a masculine energy that's seeing this about one of his friends. Because we got King of Cups and the Three of Cups. I think this is a masculine energy, okay, who's going to be realizing this about his friends. And Six of Swords, he's going to have to keep it low-key that he find this out. Because with the Seven of Cups here, he's going to be showing some sort of vision or some sort of dream. Cancer or Scorpio. That one of his friends is not to be trusted, okay? They, they playing them. Yeah, I'm hearing that they playing them, okay? They playing them, all right? I'm hearing they building them up just to bring him down, okay? Because we got the six of wands and the three of wands here, okay? The friend of me has the six of wands. Pay attention to the signs as the three of wands. Virgo, you're going to be shown some sort of vision in your dreams or just a daydream, okay? About somebody... Who's trying to portray a false image, okay? It could be with the third party, all right? Or just something that brought you pain. Four of Pentacles. Somebody trying to keep things close to the chest, but there's definitely some sort of secret here, okay? It could be with a love situation because the Ace of Cups is on the bottom of the deck. Spirits, clarify, pay attention to the signs. Queen of Swords. Yeah, somebody about to cut some shit off. Somebody about to cut some shit off, all right? With the Ace of Cups, it could be a love connection, okay? Okay? But somebody's playing stupid right now. Yeah, girl. Some some shit about to crumble. Okay? Could be with an Aries or a Scorpio. Spirits. Yeah, and the chariot car leaves the tower. I'm telling you. Somebody about to be out on somebody. Somebody about to be out on somebody, yo. Because they gonna find out something from a friend who's supposed to be this person. It could be a situation. Somebody could be in a relationship with somebody and they're going to find out something about the person that they're in a relationship with from that person's friend who's supposed to be that person's friend. They're going to find something out and that person going to be like, I'm out, bitch. Okay, it's going to be like that. Spirits, clarify, pay attention to the signs for the Cancer Zodiac, December 23rd until January 6th. Ten of Cups with the King of Cups on the bottom of the deck, honey. Yeah, okay. Yeah, there's some sort of uh, false image that somebody trying to portray on social media here concerning some sort of family dynamic. It could be with a masculine energy, a Cancer or a Scorpio, okay? Six of Swords, but there's something that this person ain't saying about whatever this situation is, okay? Or either you just not talking to this person or this person is remaining quiet, okay? Yeah, I think you walked away from this person or this person walked away from you. All right, Virgo? Yeah, they walked away from you to be in this, uh, with, with, whatever this shit is, this hierophant that they're about to be out on, okay? It's not a source, but they still, um, uh, they still carry guilt from kind of going quiet on you, okay? For not really saying what the real was concerning this situation. Last card. Spirits, clarify, watch the planets in the cosmos. Yep. So we just saw the fool card. So yeah, there's going to be some sort of new journey that somebody's going to start, um, over these next two weeks, like, somebody's going to be taking some sort of risk, okay? And it's due to, you know, some sort of planetary transit that's happening or has happened. I'm hearing happen, so I think it's that Jupiter-Saturn conjunction. It's going to be affecting you, Virgo. Spirits or somebody around you. Clarify this Watch the Planets Cosmos card for the Virgo Zodiac. Ooh. Honey. Clarify Watch the Planets slash Cosmos for the... Well, I want to say cancer. There's a cancer in here. For the Virgo Zodiac, December 23rd 
what we got ace of swords yeah somebody finna find out the truth about a certain situation some sort of three of swords energy some sort of pain all right hard fin it's concerning a commitment okay some people could be splitting up um yeah some people could be splitting up due to some sort of planetary um conjunct it's the jupiter saturn conjunction okay it's going to be affecting this situation, this um, relationship, or this commitment, or this, you know, sharing of an asset, okay? Queen of Pentacles. <sighs> so my money going to get hit. Maybe not, because Nine of Wands, they kind of guard it, okay? So maybe some money not going to get hit, all right? But Virgo, you might be watching this from the sidelines, or either you involved in this, okay? Because this could be you, Okay? Also, um, the higher, you know, the higher thing could be the universe is showing you this truth, okay? This Ace of Swords, something that maybe you need to cut off, okay? Some sort of truth. Ace of Swords and the Three of Swords, it's going to be hard for you to accept this, but it's the truth, all right? Because with the Two of Swords, like I said, because you, you, you ignore your intuition whenever it comes to a certain situation, all right? Pay attention to the signs. Spirits. Pay attention to the signs. It all in due timing. Okay, over these next two weeks, you're going to be finding out something. All right? But your intuition has been telling you about this already. All right, five of cups. You could feel some regret or some sorrow over the situation. Spirits, clarify, watch the planet slash cosmos for the Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. Need some water. So, we got the Empress, okay, underneath the Ace of Swords, okay. So, we got the Chariot, the High Priestess, and the Empress. There's another woman here with the Page of Cups here, with the Eight of Pentacles, yeah. So, somebody could be finding the truth out about another feminine energy, okay. There's a mystic in here. The High Priestess and the Empress, there's a mystic in here. Somebody's moving on. Somebody's moving on or moving toward, okay, somebody. Okay, but with the Ace of Swords, somebody's getting cut. Okay, Three of Swords. There's, a, some, there's some sort of third-party situation here as to where somebody's getting cut out. Okay, the Empress, it could be the mother of somebody's child, or it could just be, you know, like some, some outsider. Okay, a Taurus or a Libra. Okay, but somebody's moving on from someone. High Priestess, somebody already saw this happening, though, okay? They wasn't trying to see it, though. Somebody was, no, they did see it. They was playing stupid. The high priestess and two of swords, somebody was playing stupid. Okay, they didn't see this, but with the three of wands right below that, they already saw a vision about this. Two of pentacles. Yeah, it was some sort of um, back and forth situation to where somebody was juggling your ass. Justice card could have been a Libra or a Capricorn. Spirits, clarify, watch the planets and the cosmos for the Virgo Zodiac, December 23rd until January 6th. The food card, yeah. Somebody about to be single. Somebody about to be single. Somebody about to cut some shit off, okay? Honey, I gotta change some batteries. I know shit be in here, okay? But I be seeing shit at my peripheral. Like, y'all gotta chill. Damn, man. Y'all be fucking with me sometimes, okay? So we got the three of cups, the three of wands, and the food card. So somebody's seen a vision about this situation, okay? It could have been with a friend, a third party, okay? A cancer or Aries. But somebody's just going to take a risk and be like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm about to cut this shit off. And I'm about to be single. I'm about to enjoy my life, okay? In due time, though, this person makes this decision. Eight of wands. Somebody about to move. Somebody is about to move, okay? Legit move and literally move on, okay? It could be a Sagittarius as well. Yeah, somebody about to... Whole new state, whole new city, whole new life. Like, bitch, I'm out, okay? Three to the eight of wands. The difference between that is five of wands. Yeah, somebody's getting out of some sort of conflict. It could be with a Leo. The six of wands is here as well. Spirits, clarify, watch the planet slash cosmos for the Virgo Zodiac. December 23rd until January 6th. Last card. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Damn. Eight of Swords with the higher fan. Yo, well, what is this commitment? They keep showing up, Virgo. Yeah, somebody was trying to hide a, um, some sort of some sort of truth about um, a family dynamic. Six of Wands, Ten of Cups, and the Eight of Swords. Yeah, somebody was trying to be all on social media like, "Oh, we're the best." You know that kind of you know dumb shit. Okay, Lou, do you know this person is keeping keeping a certain secret about this situation? Okay. 
Ace of Swords, the truth is going to come out, though, over these next two weeks about something, all right? The world card, okay? Um, I'm just hearing this. This is phasing out, okay? I, don't see, I haven't seen the death card with the Ace of Swords and the world card. Somebody's outgrowing a certain situation, okay? Somebody's also finding out about, some, like I said, some sort of third-party situation, Okay. Yeah, I'm hearing somebody doesn't want to give somebody a commitment. Okay, because we got King of Pentacles and the Four of Pentacles behind the uh, Hierophant. And those will all be Taurus energies. There's a masculine energy here who doesn't want to give somebody a commitment. It could be somebody who he has a child with. Okay, because the Empress is here. But he don't want to give somebody a commitment. All right? Because he could have found out something about this woman. And he like, bitch, you're done. Okay, you're cut. Yeah, something has been hidden from you, Virgo. Okay, it could be with the Gemini or any um, air sign that's going to be revealed with re revealed to you with the Ace of Swords. There's a certain there's a certain planetary transit that's going to happen to where you find this um you find this out. But you are already being shown the signs. Two of Swords, High Priestess, Three of Wands, and Ten of Cups. You might be playing stupid for right now, but you are already seeing what the fuck going on. Okay, because there's somebody here who's trying to um you know create some sort of illusion here but that shit gonna get found out so we got keep it low key spirits clarify this keep it low key card for the virgo zodiac december 24 wands and the ten of swords somebody trying to keep it low key there's some there's some sort of um living situation is ending okay could be with the aries or gemini that's the truth that's <laughs> that's the truth that's the truth that's coming out. Ace of Swords and the Ten of Swords. Somebody is, um, a living situation is ending with someone, okay? Yeah, somebody losing a lease or something like that. And somebody trying to keep that low key, okay? Two of Cups. Yeah, girl. This is the weirdest thing. So it's like one living situation ends and another living situation begins. Like somebody gets out of one living situation and either they, you know, go be single, they do their thing, or they move in with somebody to a cup who they actually got feelings for. It could be a Cancer, okay, a Aries or a Gemini or Sag. Okay, this happens fast. Okay, they move in with this other person. Keep it low keto. Spirits, clarify, keep it low key for the Virgo Zodiac, December 23rd until January 6th. Five of Wands, a lot of conflict here. Leo energy with the Four of Cups. Yeah, somebody, um, Cancer Leo energy. There's somebody here, Five of Wands, Five of Wands, Five of Wands, Five of Wands, who's in a lot of conflict here. They're keeping it low key. They don't want somebody to know about it. But with the Four of Cups, they want to be out of it. Like, they don't want to be in this energy anymore. They, they're, I'm hearing they're bored of this shit, okay? Nine of Wands, they're very guarded. Nine minus five is four. It's in that living situation that's about to end, okay? But somebody just playing their cards for right now. It's like, I'll chill just for a little minute, okay? Just know I'm out, all right? Nine of Pentacles, the Sun card, and the Devil card. Yes, yeah, somebody is finding out about a toxic situation that was going on. Um, could be you, Virgo, because the Nine of Pentacles is here. All right. Somebody's shedding light on some sort of toxic energy, a toxic person, a toxic situation. Okay, some sort of addiction that somebody has. Leo Capricorn energy. I'm hearing somebody found out that somebody was, you know, lying about some money. Ace of Cups. Somebody found out that somebody was in love with somebody else. Okay, Six of Pentacles. I told you somebody found out about somebody's money. Somebody was lying about where they were spending their money. Okay, somebody lied about being independent as well. Um, somebody lied about giving money to a child. Somebody lied about a child. Somebody lied about a child. Knight of Wands and the page. Girl, Cancer had this too. Somebody lied about a child. Knight of Wands and the page of Wands. With the King of Cups and the High Fan, somebody was in a relationship with somebody who they did not have a child by. They actually had a one night stand, and it's that person's child. And they trying to keep that shit low key because it's a lot of drama. Okay, Sagittarius energy. Very toxic, okay? But somebody's finding this out. Virgo, goddamn. Go check out Cancer Reading because they had some drama too, okay? But over these next two weeks, show in January, there's going to be like a lot of shit being found. I got to change these batteries, okay? 
Okay, Virgo, please like the video, leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. Um, follow me on Instagram at Monique and Miss It with two Y's. <laughs> DM me on there if you would like a book of personal tarot reading with me. And also check the description box and the pinned comment in the comment section for all the spiritual business that I support. Okay, y'all? Honey, get it together. Okay, y'all? I keep picking this up. And this keeps being uh, left out. Don't believe the hype, Virgo. That's something that somebody is... I feel like somebody is trying to portray a certain image for right now. Don't believe the hype, kid. Don't believe the hype. That shit gonna come out in January. It's something that is gonna come out due to a certain planetary transit. Don't believe the hype, y'all. Bye.